Hey YouTube, Snowman38. One thing that I've never understood is why people will pay out a bunch of money for something that they can make themselves. Uh, especially with something as simple as this. A stock bag or a shooter's bag for precision shooting. Um, being out on a farm, I like to hunt coyote a lot. And I move from position to position as I need to, whatnot, and I've lost like three of these shooter's bags because I'll get in a good position and I'll get set up and then I'll do a call and I'll hear them somewhere else and I'll move. And in the process of trying to get out of there quick to get to my other position, I'll walk off and leave my bag and there you go. Um, instead of paying like $50 for one of these, go to Walmart, go to Target, someplace like that, and buy yourself a nice set of brown socks. Then on your way back from that department, go and get yourself some dry beans. And then go get yourself some zip ties. Fill your sock up about halfway with the beans. Pull it tight, zip tie it, fold it over itself, and then stitch the cuff of the sock to the toe of the sock. Now you've got yourself a shooter's bag. It works every bit as good as one that would be filled with sand or something like that. I actually like the beans a little bit more. Uh, it gives you just a little bit more movement when you have something in it. You know, give it a good squeeze and you can adjust your elevation. It holds pretty good. Is it going to perform as good as like an Accuracy International sandbag? No. But you know what? I didn't pay $50 for it either. Just a little trick. Save you some money.